Hi, this is Mr. New, and in this mini lesson, we're going to learn how to create a mask layer in Flash Professional CS5. Let's go ahead and get started. First of all, in creating a mask, we want to be able to get rid of everything that is outside of the stage area. In order to do that, we will start by creating a new layer, and I'm going to go ahead and create a layer directly above the mountains. That's going to be the, the main layer I want to mask out. I'm going to name that layer mask. Now, this doesn't matter what I name it. I can name this anything I want, but by calling it mask, it reminds me that that's exactly what it is. Once I create that mask layer, I want to create a rectangle with no stroke, and I want the rectangle to be a very bright color that is not in my image. I'm gonna go with a bright green. So now that I create the rectangle, I'm going to select the rectangle, Make sure that Align to Stage is checked. Check Match Width and Height. Align Horizontal Center. Align Horizontal Vertical. And now that green square is exactly the same size as my stage. If I click off of that, I can now go down to my mask layer, right click, and click Mask. The mask now has masked out the mountains. Now notice how both layers are locked. I also want to mask the sun layer. So I'm going to go ahead and click on the sun layer. I'm going to drag it above the mountains, below the mask. And notice we see the green. That means I just need to relock the sun. And if I should want to also mask the sky, I first need to drag the sky above the mask. Then click and drag it all the way back down below the mountains and lock that layer. I have now successfully masked all the layers in my image. If at any time I want to see what it looks like without it being masked, all I need to do is click on the little dot below the eye next to mask, and I can see my original artwork. That hides it. Click again, and it masks out that layer. That's it for masking a layer. This has been Mr. New with Flash Professional CS5.